Hey guys, we've got a total ab and full body workout today to work those abs and your entire body. I've also got no jumping variations included, so I got you covered. As always, you can include this workout in your usual routine or you can join the rest of us by following a 15-day schedule on my website. Now smash that thumbs up button, leave a comment down below and let's get started. We've got 3 sets today, 30 to 50 seconds on and 5 to 15 seconds off. Get on your mat and we're starting with hollow late circles. Lift your arms up like so as you make leg circles. Engage that core and make sure your back is not arched. Start drawing the circle in one direction and you can also rest your hands beside you if this is too hard. Now go in the opposite direction. Alright, stay put, no break here. We're going to do some leg rollouts. Lift your legs up, drop it down slow and control, then bend and lift your legs up again and repeat. We've got a short break here and we're on to V-seat scissors, so get seated on your butt. Put your arms to the side, lean back, cross one leg over the other like scissors, engage that core and feel that burn. Stay where you are, no breaks, we are doing angle V crunch. Pull your knees towards your chest and extend them outwards, angle to the side, then repeat on the other side. Great work guys, now lay flat on your mat with your hands extended and we've got twisting chops next. Use your core muscles to lift yourself up, then twist and chop to the left while bringing your legs off the mat. Go back down and repeat on the other side. You can also rest your feet on the mat while you are twisting if this is too hard. No break here, we've got V-cycles next. Lean back on your palms slightly and do some cycles. Remember to squeeze your abs. Great work guys, quick 10 seconds rest now and we're doing some reverse crunches. Lift your legs up high using your core muscles and come down gentle. Make sure your core is engaged and doing all the work here and try not to swing your legs back and forth too much. No break, we've got leg drops next. Focus on your abs and feel that burn.
Nice work guys, short rest again now, we are going to do side plank, reach through. If you're feeling tired or need a break, just do the exercise while on knees. Now rest while going straight to the other side. You're doing well guys, lay flat on the mat and we've got a roll up foot tap next. I mess up on my first rep as I roll up but use your hand to touch your opposite foot, then repeat on the other leg. Now rest here guys, we are going straight into bicycle crunches. Remember to squeeze your abs and keep pushing through, you can do this. Another quick 10 seconds rest and we've got 4 more exercises and we're done with set 1. Get in a low plank position with your butt up, then return into a plank position and bring your knee in to your chest. We are going straight into mountain climbers next. Let's do this. You're doing well guys, final superset here, we've got plank taps next. You can also do the low impact tap if you want to. Now rest, we are going straight into plank with hip dips. Engage your core, this is the last exercise for set 1. Set one done, take a longer break if you need to, get on your feet and we're starting the next set with a squat to toe tap.
Start with a squat and tap your feet with the opposite hand. If you're struggling with balance, just take it nice and slow, you'll get better at it over time. Alright, next we are doing a lateral lunge followed by a side raise and crunch. Sit your hips back as you lunge down and make sure the other leg is as straight as possible. Get up and do a side leg raise with a side crunch. And now onto the other side. Alright, next we are doing a deadlift to knee raise. Do this on your ground instead of your mat if it helps with grip and balance. Hinge on your hips as you lift your legs up while maintaining a neutral back. Come back up and give your ab a good squeeze. to the other side. Nice work guys, not long to go and we'll be done with set 2. Get on your mat for some push-up variations. Start with a push-up, make sure your elbows are not flare out, then do a downward dog. For low impact, just do it on your knees. We're doing a push-up into a child pose, then back into push-up again. Now get into a reverse tabletop position for some knee touches. Quick 10 seconds rest and we're doing some squat reach jacks. Keep pushing guys, you are doing great coming this far. Start with a squat with your hands reaching the ground and stand up and jump into a jack. For low impact, just don't do the hop.
Last one for set 2, we've got knee walk to squat. Start on your knees, then get up by remain in a low squat position, then back down and repeat. Alternate the leg after 15 seconds. Great work guys, that's the end of set 2. Take a longer break if you want to, we are starting the final set with some overhead jacks. Jack your feet to the side with your hands together reaching upwards. For low impact, just do it without the fast jacks. No rest, we're going straight into standing crunches. Make sure you squeeze your abs and bring your knee close to your chest. Not long to go guys, get in a high plank position and we're doing some shoulder tap followed by reach. Then do the same on the other side. No rest here, we're going straight into a downward dog knee tuck. Keep pushing through guys, you can also raise one leg up if you want to make it harder. Alright, lay flat on the mat, but don't fall asleep. <laughs> We're going to do some T raises. Make sure your core is engaged, give yourself a thumbs up, and lift your arms and feet like so. We've got this, guys, not long to go. No rest here, we're doing a prone arm reach. It's a similar move, but you're drawing a semicircle here. Now get in a reverse tabletop position and we're doing a reverse lateral walk. If this is too hard, just do a hold. That's totally fine, it's still challenging. Last super set guys, we've got in and out. Time to smash those abs real hard. Squeeze your abs.
No rest, get flat on your mat and we're doing some straight leg crunches to wrap this up. You can have your knee bent when you're flat on the mat and as you crunch up, have your legs straightened. Let's do this guys, we are nearly there. And that's the workout guys, 20 minutes that will do your body good. Drop me a comment down below how you like it, smash that like button and I'll see you in the next workout. Bye guys!